Clarkson, I know you have to be very happy with so many things about the city of New Orleans, and sports are playing a large part of driving this economic engine here. Yes, they are. Sports have always been a favorite in this city for my lifetime. We've always been a, a sports-oriented city and a sports capital in many ways, and it's because uh, New Orleans loves to own our own talent. You know, think about it, if it's whether it's music or whether it's chefs or athletes. If they're ours, they're great. We rally around them, we support them, and that leads to excitement and it leads to a lot of people coming and being a part of it and supporting. And it leads to a lot of championships. I mean, look at, look at this, the Saints, mm -hmm. look at BCS championships with LSU. I mean, come mm -hmm. on, we have, yeah. we've been there. <laughs> it's remarkable. And then you look at the events, it's dizzying to think about what we have coming up. Of course, the Sugar Bowl, oh. National Championship game, the Final Four, Women's Final Four, yeah. Super Bowl, and now the Arena Bowl. It's and just remarkable. Final Four, yes. Yeah. Uh, you know, at, mm -hmm. at 2012 mm -hmm. and 2013 mm -hmm. are going to just be out of control. And we get, it's wonderful. And uh, it's, it's great to live in a city that can have NFL, NBA, and arena too. Mm -hmm. There's something for everybody. To, to have the Arena Bowl here, for them to decide they're going to go to a neutral site for the first time since they did it here in New Orleans in 2008, speaks volumes about what the league thinks about this city. Yes, it does. And I was there and it was wonderful. Mm -hmm. And so, um, and the place was packed. People love it. Mm -hmm. And then from the standpoint of the city right now, loving it as you do and being here as long as you have, to see where it's at now as compared to where we were in August in 2005, it truly is a great story, isn't it? It's, it's one of a kind in America because we, we were 80% underwater. And a lot of the national press was saying we'd never recover. And as I said to one of them on television that during that week, because I was at Ground Zero, I said, this city will recover because the spirit is not underwater. And that's our city. There was never a doubt that we'd revive. But we needed the leadership we have now to ensure that we do it quickly and do it right. And uh, this mayor and this city council are really putting us on the map. I'm proud to be a part of it. Should be. Jackie, thank you for the visit. Keep up the great work. God bless thank you and your family. Nice to see you again, too.